today, crews set to break ground on a new international container terminal at Jack's Port, part of a $238 million plan to expand and upgrade the Blunt Island facility. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding explains the port's impact economically to our area. And the mayor will be there along with officials from Jack's Port and SSA Maritime for that groundbreaking. Now, the groundbreaking comes on the heels of Jack's Port releasing its economic impact report, saying jobs are coming in and revenue is going up. It's an important day in Jack's Port history. Today, the port is marking the construction of its new international container terminal with a groundbreaking. At the event today, the Jack's Port Board Vice Chairman will be presented with a $20 million grant as part of the more than $238 million plan to expand the facility. As News for Jack's has reported, it's been a year of movement for Jack's Port. This past August, the Port Authority released its economic report showing cargo activity through the seaport generates more than 26,000 jobs in Northeast Florida, plus more than $31 billion in economic output. That report showed more than 26,000 people in our area were employed, a nearly 8% increase from five years ago. The project to deepen the channel to 47 feet is still ongoing, and according to Jack's Port officials, it's ahead of schedule, expected to be completed in 2023. Officials say the project will allow the facility to accommodate more cargo aboard bigger ships. And despite critics of the project, Jack's Port officials say they have seen both port and job growth as the project pushes on. And that groundbreaking is happening this morning. I will be there to cover it. I'll have the update later on today. Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station.